Hello, gentlemen and ladies. Thought I'd bring you along and look at a tank battery, an old abandoned tank battery. This one is another one of those field tanks. This is kind of neat. It's, it's actually got an API monogram. Notice the build date. 1983. 12 foot diameter, 15 foot height, 300 barrel nominal capacity, shell 3 16 of inch thick, deck height 3 16 of inch thick, bottom quarter inch. F type floor, 16 ounce pressure, so one pound. Has a flush clean out just one big flat door nothing too crazy there's three of them sit here two steels and a fiberglass both the steel tanks were built in 83 flush clean outs walk around here to the other side this one's got something kind of interesting to show you guys occasionally you'll see you know these things a lot of times they had um, gauge boards or some other type of way to, to show the height. And this one here is just an ordinary weighted cable. And they're running it inside a piece of clear plastic tube that's literally been fiberglass to the tank to hold it. I guess they realized they didn't want to weld to the tank. So, and it's a fiberglass neighbor sitting here. I don't know what age it's from, but uh, it's got the same storyboard weight level gauge on it. Walk around here to the manway. Maybe it's... Oh, it does have a nameplate. Excellent. Oh, built by Palmer Tanks. Palmer Tanks and Andrew. Let's see. There's the date, 2002, so quite a bit newer. Quite a bit newer. Just a brine water tank, so set it up here with three three tanks sitting here. One for salt water and two for oil. It looks like they were decommissioned a while ago. We'll have to walk down and look at that that vertical separator. Those are kind of interesting to, to look at. Don't see very many of those. And I don't remember the last time I saw one in service. I'm sure there's some of them still being used. Anyway, thought uh, thought you guys might find these old tanks sitting out here in West Texas kind of interesting. Every once in a while I get back over to this area of the country. And when the wind's not blowing and the temperature's nice, it's actually kind of a nice place. Not a bad sunset to see for the work day. Anyway, thanks for coming along, guys. Talk to you later. Bye.